Turner, but you're right. Coach Tomlin was pretty clear about the fact that Antonio Brown would have used it. blocked into the end zone. Free ball and picked up for the touchdown by Pittsburgh. Not the beginning that the Browns were hoping for. See the pressure coming right up the middle. Anthony Ciccolo. Ciccolo with the block and the ball spins and Ciccolo recovers it. See the rotation, the spin on the ball doesn't cause it to go out of the back of the end zone, but stay in bounds. Not the start that the Browns were, were hoping for or anticipating. Three and out on offense and then getting the opening punt blocked. In fact, it's head coach Hugh Jackson's worst nightmare. Kaiser pulls it down, running out of time, and goes down at the 30-yard line. And that is Chicolo. Kaiser holding on to it again and going down again at the 27-yard line. This time Cameron Hayward, number 97. Third and eight. Kaiser with time. Lots of time over the middle. That is complete. The 40-yard line, that's Johnson. And Johnson breaking tackles. Moves out to the 47 or 48-yard line for a first down. Deshaun Kaiser going to keep it and sneak for the touchdown. Crowell in the backfield. Crowell. They fake it to him. Kaiser on his feet and over the middle. And did he catch it? Close to the 40-yard line. They say yes. Corey Coleman. Four offensive drives, four punts for the Steelers. Pepper from his own 10. Right up the middle of the field and across the 30, across the 35. Second and seven. Roethlisberger. Over the middle, that's caught at the 35. Antonio Brown on his horse and tackled inside the 40-yard line. Derek Kindred made the saving tackle. About that the Steelers needed to try and get Antonio Brown working the middle of the field. It looks like they actually get a hand on the ball. I want to say that was Schobert underneath it. Looked like that ball was even tipped a little bit. Another quick pass to the outside, and that is complete. And again, Antonio Brown, and Brown inside the five. It'll be first and goal. Roethlisberger throwing over the middle, and is caught for the touchdown. And that's Jesse James, the tight end. On this drive, 53, middle linebacker for the Browns. More of a run-stuffing guy, getting in great position, just goes for the ball and just the timing of it's off and he doesn't make contact with it. Kaiser, gonna go down. Once again, the third sack of the day for the Pittsburgh defense. What the Steelers and Browns were able to do offensively. On second and six. Kaiser going to the near side. That is complete. And uh, inside the 20 is Seth DeValve. And DeValve all the way to the 12 and a first down. Hurry, hurry, son. Kaiser dancing around and then is going to go down at about the 17 yard line. Make it the 18th. Fourth time today that Kaiser has been sacked. Zane Gonzalez from 24 yards out. And it's good. Start again now from the 25. Roethlisberger, sideline. And the catch is made at about the 40-yard line by Martavis Bryant. Looks left. Pump fake. Pass underneath, and it's good for the touchdown to the tight end, Jesse James. His second touchdown catch of the day. Bell that splits out left so two defenders go that way you pump that way and then 
Jesse James, who's blocking on the end in protection. He does a late leak. You can see the offensive line work their way upfield. That's a called tight end screen to the inside. Ball was going to go, was it? <laughs> no. Brady! Second and 15. Play fake. Kaiser. Looking. Looking. And goes down at the 16-yard line, courtesy of T.J. Watt. Isaiah Crowell in the Brady! backfield. Fake it to him. Kaiser with all kinds of time and under through the ball. It's intercepted. Picked off by T.J. Watt. Well, this is just a two receiver route. The right, the tight end to the right stays in. Hard play fake. T.J. Watt is over the slot. Ricardo Lewis actually gets a free release. They need the 20 for a first down. Over the middle and intercepted. Tipped and then intercepted is Derek Kindred. Kindred on his way back into the 30-yard line. Another quick slam. And that is caught by Brown. Usual normal jolly self, no matter what uniform he's wearing. Kaiser flips it to Crowell. Crowell got the first down before stepping out of bounds on the far side of the field. Kaiser over the middle, and he's got his man at the 35-yard line, Ricardo Lewis. Sometimes you got to lace that ball in there, and that's exactly what Kaiser did on that throw. 29-yard pickup, and Kaiser again. That is complete. And under the 20, under the 15, to about the 10-yard line goes Isaiah Crowell. Play, play clock now down to two. Got the playoff in time. Looking left, throwing on the slant. Did he get in? Penalty markers fly. I think it's and a, a touchdown. touchdown. It is. <laughs> Corey Coleman. There may be a couple players hurt on that collision. 98. And here we go for two. Going to hand it off and up the middle is Crowell. Made it look easy. What a great job up front. Great job up front. You can see it looks like the run is supposed to go to the right side, but that's where the Steelers attack it. Cruel with the vision and the cutback. Roethlisberger with time, lots of time, still looking. And down the sideline it is caught by Antonio Brown. Oh, what a catch. Antonio Brown is lined up on the right side of the field. He just does a 12 to 15 yard dig route. And as he sees Ben scramble and slide, he just looks for an open window in the defense. First down, under two and a half to play. Le'Veon Bell. Running room on the side, and there he goes, 30. Before he stood up at about the 29 yard line. Last 20 seconds will wind down with no further action on the field other than the handshakes. Pittsburgh, the defending AFC North champs, 11-5 and five a year ago. They ring up another opening day. They have won eight consecutive regular season games and 30-5 and five against the Browns since the year 2000.